Welcome back everybody to C-Tech Tools. Today we'll be talking about the new Milwaukee screwdriver that um, is mostly for HVAC and we'll do a comparison to their older generation screwdrivers. As you can see, I'm just holding the second gen and I also got the first gen. A lot of people did like this one, and um, but this will be the newest one. It's usually for HVAC. It has Schrader valve caps, so let's open it up. Right off, you can tell that they put in a lot of the, um, design into it. Um, they're going off of their new screwdriver uh, cushion grip type screwdrivers that they had. They released last year. And that's what they're mainly going for. But you can tell it has a nice feel to it. And also um, <clears throat> very, uh, very, very sturdy. And the grip is pretty, it's amazing, spot on, amazing and you have the model number there lasered etched on the actual um screwdriver and uh it, it pretty much looks like the same it's just you know it has a straighter valve it does have the the little uh, the holes to make little loops on it but you, you initially you get what you get in a in an 11 and 1 or a 13 and 1 the only difference is that you know the cushion is a lot better than you know their previous screwdrivers you could tell right off the bat uh, you got your Phillips, your flathead, and then you know, on the other side you got the, your number two, and then your bigger flathead. But uh, I didn't, I did notice that putting it back in is is it has to go a certain way. It's not like the others that fits relatively. However, you uh, stick it inside the hole. Uh, this one it has two stops, and you have to get it in right. If not, it won't go in. Um, besides that, I mean. It's a pretty great screwdriver. Uh, you can't go wrong. You can get them uh, right now at uh, Tool Barn. And mainly what I got it for is for HVAC. This will be going in the HVAC backpack uh, for Schrader valves and whatnot. And it, it is helpful because sometimes, you know, if you're missing the little screw, uh, the Schrader valve tip, and it'll save, it'll, it'll save you. And it has the square tips on the other end. I mean, nothing, nothing too fancy. It's just, you know, I do like the cushion grip on it. Um, it's like it's a way better than the other ones. Like I was saying, you can only put it in the hole one certain way. Um, it has a little two notches and and that's the only way it'll go. It's not that is a little downfall, you know, not a deal breaker. But here's a comparison with the the last gen model they released. Uh, the last gen model was a little bit thicker at the very bottom. Uh, it was uh, you would be able to you were able to hold it on your palm very good but it kind of got cumbersome at times and you know this one has a 13 and one it shows right away and this is the first generation this is the one that started it all for Milwaukee it's a screwdriver line you know it had the for the wire cutter and to me that was a it was a gimmick for uh, a lot of reasons because I never used it uh, when I did try to use it it never really worked um, but on the second generation, they, they, you know, they went a different route, and I really did like the design, and, it, you know, eh, but, you know, the newer designs for the screwdriver, other cushion grip, um, uh, it, it's just a lot better, plus you can get some torque on the, um, the newer one, and, you know, size comparison, you do get a longer shaft on the newer one, they, they've grown them a tad bit over the years, and this is, this is the next generation of where Milwaukee's going at. With their screwdriver line i'll be expecting to see that's the kind of handle they'll be using for quite a while um maybe three to four years until they uh they go back and try to try something else but and that's pretty much it here's a more of a that way you can see around it it has a 13 and one the very you know bold letters the shredder valve tip and overall, if you buy this one for HVAC, you can't go wrong. There is the Klein competition, uh, the newer Klein one that has the 5 sixteenths and the quarter inch that you mainly use in HVAC. And I do like it. I thought about getting it, but the cushion on this one is superior to the Klein. I've already seen the Klein and the, the grip for this one is superior to the Klein. And right now, what I'm going to go do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a sneak peek on my HVAC backpack and I'm going to go stick it in the backpack. Let's go. This is my 
HVAC backpack. And this is where it will be going. Here's a little sneak peek on my HVAC tech backpack. If you guys are interested in a tech backpack, I do have a video for that one. But this is all HVAC and installation for HVAC. If you want a video about my HVAC backpack, comment down below.